What's up guys, Dark Heartless here, and today we are finally back with another Red Dead Redemption 2 video. So I hope you guys are hyped as I am, so let's get into it. Wanted me to have a word with few of the folks on the property here. Emmett Lee. Alright. Have a word. But I ain't got the time to help you. Obliged. Well, damn, okay. Well then don't help us, I guess. That's kind of BS if you ask me. I mean, you're over here guarding the door. You should be able to tell us where the hell we gotta go. What are you waiting for? Sure. I'm already through the door, you dumb mother frigger. Alright, let's go ask this gentleman right here. See if he knows where people are at. Alright, buddy, you know what we need? Hey, uh, I was hoping you'd talk a moment. I'm a student of the history of the region, and... Uh, I ain't the one to speak to. Try Master Bo. Think he's down there by the wood store. Boy's got all the time in the world. Down there near the wood store? Okay. I don't know exactly where that is, but we're gonna go ahead and find it. Oh, I thought we were gonna have to jump over these. <laughs> uh, apparently not. Alright. So, I'm assuming that he's in the door. Let's go ahead and try that. Hello? Housekeeping? Um, okay. Um, is this mission bugged out? Um, I guess we can try to look around the building and see exactly, but... I don't know why the hell it's not working. Oh, maybe this is him. Oh, okay, here he is. It's kind of weird to sit there and say that he's around here and then... Uh, I'll see you at the sheriff's office. Excuse me, friend. We friends? Not yet, but he is hoping. I guess. We don't get a lot of traveling men here, and suddenly there's a whole family. Damn, bro, look at his yellow ass teeth, bro. Holy shit. Helpful Yankees about the place. Is there? What are you doing here? I was just looking for work. Well, looking for something. Don't worry, your secret's safe with me. What secret? I got a secret of my own. Are you secretly normal? Excuse me? Never mind. <laughs> he said, are you secretly is, normal? I don't care if you kill the whole lot of us and the Braithwaite. I don't want to kill it. Damn, okay. This dude is suicidal, I guess. Who? Penelope. But it's impossible. Well, love tends to be complicated. That it does, my friend. That it does. I'm Gray, son of Tavish Gray, nephew of Lee Gray, the sheriff, grandson of old Murdo Gray. We Greys have been loyal to the state and murderers to the Braithwaites for so long now, no one can even quite explain why. Beyond blind loyalty and stupidity, I'm supposed to be loyal to some nonsense while she... She's amazing. She's like a woman from the future. She's like tomorrow, if tomorrow turns out fine. Well, I'm sorry Man, she got that cat that be pulling the soul out of this poor man. Involved. He's... He's, Gang he's got it bad. Seems unseemly. I'll pay. I've got money. We Greys, we've always got money. No brains mine, but money. Well, in that case... I know she loves to sit out in the gazebo on the edge of the Braithwaite property. Take her this letter and this bracelet, please. All right, well, guys, let's go ahead and uh, give this Penelope her stuff. So let's go ahead and fast forward, shall we? All right, we got our friend over here Penelope hopefully she doesn't send these guys on us and kill us but maybe she's a nice person who knows are you Penelope Braithwaite well yes I am I've got a letter for you oh. and a gift <laughs> a letter and a gift well we don't even know each other <laughs> well it's not from me it's from uh... from Bo <gasps> oh he is so Oh. Strange. I was about yes, to say that it's myself. Yeah. Strange, but also so human. The rest of our families are stuck in the dark ages, or well, I don't know, cave people, perhaps. Bo's different. But if they find out, they'll kill him and send me to live someplace awful, like Ohio. Have you ever been to Ohio, sir? No. Well, neither have I. But my uncle has a factory there. He was sort of the black sheep on account of having left. But now they tolerate him because he's a vicious snob. Families are, are, they're something else. <laughs> you got a family, sir? No, not really. Well, they tolerate him because of the money. 
But me, with my ideas above my station, they can't stand. That sounds pretty complicated. I, I don't know quite what to say. Well, nothing to say, except I hope they all rot. I don't. Uh, well, maybe a bit. But here, if you see Bo again, will you give this to him? Sure. All right, guys. So looks like we have another successful mission. Um, eventually, we will do this mission where we have to give Bo his letter. Um, but we're going to go ahead and adventure a little bit, shall we? All right. Seems like we got hey, hey, somebody that wants our attention, I guess. What do you need? Oh. Oh. Uh, thanks for stopping, sir. Thank you. Um, Percy Whitsickle. Central Union Railroad Company. <laughs> he doesn't even want to shake your hand, bro. What am I? Don't be a bitch now. Oh, you're one of those. You gotta talk about somebody behind their back. I can't stand mofos like you. One of my workers has been stealing wages. Stealing Three wages? Weeks, Damn. Man. Three weeks. I have searched everyone and everywhere ten times over. Of course, no one is talking the way they look at me. What's all this got to do with me? Oh, uh, I just, I think I need someone a little more neutral, a little more persuasive. And, and, and you look like you're, uh, you know, and I got to watch the camp, so could you see what you could sniff out? I'll pay you for your efforts, of course. Yeah, I got it. What exactly is it you want me to do? Find the thief and recover the money. And give him his marching orders. I'm not one for matters of personnel. Look for anyone sneaking off the line. They've got to be stashing it away from camp somewhere. Well, can you help me? My head is on the block here. <laughs> I guess we'll help you out, friend. I'll see what I can do. Thank exactly. You. Thank you. Yeah, no, uh, no worries there, my guy. All right, let's go ahead and get into the area real quick. All right, so we got to look for a person that apparently is trying to get off the line. I don't see anybody yet, but that's not saying that they're not going to try. So maybe it's this guy right here. He kind of doesn't seem like he's working. Uh, well, that's kind of fucked up. Oh, who said that? Oh. Oh. Oh, I always love people that are in charge, that are doing wrong, but they're going to blame the other people. Don't know if anybody else has that at their job, but Stupid. it happens a hell of a lot. Alright, so it says that we got to be kind of like incognito, I think it said. Like, you got to sneak up on him without him knowing. Alright, so I think the best way to do that would be to crouch... And then we're just going to sit there and let him basically incriminate himself. And uh, that way we don't have to really do much of the work. We're just going to come over here and find him taking the money or putting the money up. It's kind of stupid that you would steal from your own job, bro. I mean, if you're, you know, paying bills and shit, the dumbest thing you could ever do is steal from your own job. That's dumb as hell. But apparently nobody told this guy. Where the hell did he put this money? Good lord. He's like really off the damn line. He's like one of those supervisors that take multiple breaks but never actually do work but then tell you how tired they are. Alright, so I'm thinking that he's behind this tree. Maybe near this big rock looking thing. Hopefully we can actually get him red-handed. Would be nice. Are right, you over here? No. Nope. Alright, so he must be somewhere around. Oh, see there he is. I don't want to see his, you know, his tin tin. So, okay, he's just doing the money. What's up hey. there, buddy? What are you doing here? What does it look like I'm doing? Percy a little favor. He says one of the workers has been stealing. Exactly. Stealing, bro. Him. 
Stealing? <laughs> what? I, I'm the junior foreman here. It, it's them Orientals you want to speak to. Hello, buddy. You ready to return that money you stole? Okay. Okay. All right. All right. I'm leaving. The money is in the tree. Just please don't kill me. I mean, I think we should kill him, but, you know, we're going to let him go. We're going to let him go. All right. Looks like we got the money. How much is there? Damn, a hundred dollars? Holy crap. All right, let's go ahead and return to Percy. Um, don't know how much he's going to give us for this, but you never know. Could be half, maybe. I mean, that would be a pretty steep reward, but... Oh, damn, almost fell. The way that Arthur runs makes me laugh every time. Alright, get up, get up. What, uh, I was gonna say, like, what? Exactly, get out of the way, man. Maybe I'll check back on you later then. Alright, I guess that's it for the mission. I guess we did it. Let's go ahead on to the next mission or interaction, shall we? Damn, is it, I mean, if that's a you and a woman in there, bro, I don't really want to... Sounds like she's sucking a demon out of you. Oh, you shit. Nope, never mind. I was trying to help. Exactly. Alright, let me get my... Let me get my freaking... Oh, I can't get my... Oh, damn, are they going to kill me? No, 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 hang on. Yeah, there we go. Double wheel them, baby. Next time... Be it, exactly. Be smarter next time, bro. Alright, guys, on to the next interaction or mission. Alright, so now we have one of our legendary um, animals. Um, we've done, I think, two of them so far. So let's go ahead and do the third one. Alright, so this one actually took me quite a while to find the uh, dung or the feces. Um... Yeah, exactly. It did take us a while because it said that, like, we we're in the legendary area, but, like I said, it doesn't tell you where, so you have to, like, search for the shit. You can't just, like, it. it's, it's all gray, so you have to, like, check the area. It doesn't tell you specifics. But once we found it, we were able to kind of track it, so this part became a little... Oh, we went a little too far. So this part became a little bit easier because once you find it, it, it's pretty much straightforward. It's finding it that's the hard part. Alright, let's see. So we're still going this way. Alright, so we have another area right here that we can inspect. That's pretty good. At least it's telling us exactly where we have to go. Sometimes it doesn't. Alright, so it might be like a fur or like a broken branch or something like that. Alright, here we go. Alright, so it's fur this time. Gotta be close. Alright. So let's see. It's saying that it's this way. So let's see. Usually, like, if you're pretty close to it, it, like, the animal, like, glows, kind of. So. Well, this is the end of the thing. I don't see it. Um. Like I said, this is the other hard part about legendary animals, because sometimes you just, even though it says it's in this area, it may not be in. Alright, so let's go back the other way and try and see if we can't find it going the other way. Sometimes if you go the other way and it's not there, just go back and it should be, like, in the next direction. Alright, let me grab my gun. Alright. I 
I don't see it anywhere. What the hell are they talking about, bro? Man. Okay. Well, it looks like it gypped us. Um, let's see. Hang on. Let me just chill in this area real quick. Alright, so now it's telling us to go back over there, which, like I said, these legendary animals, I'm, I'm kind of like um, debating on whether or not I'm going to continue to do this because it does take a whole lot of time. And like you see right here, the, the game is not very forward on what exactly you're supposed to do. So it does consume a lot of time. Um, are we going to see it at all? Oh, there it is. Where did it? Oh, I missed the head. Alright. I actually read online that um, it doesn't actually matter with the legendary animals. Um, because it's going to be a three star no matter what. But that is the legendary fox, ladies and gents. You go and give this to, uh, what do they call it? Tamper or, or whatever it's called. or And they, uh, they give you some extra... Uh, legendary stuff it's pretty cool I must say all right so let's go on to the next one Please help me. the hell's wrong with you bro are you trying to steal from me bro oh you got snake bite all right never mind I was about to blow a hole in you bro man you must suck at life bro Suck it out of me, please. You're damn lucky I have this. Yeah, I ain't sucking shit out of nobody, bro. Arthur Morgan's a badass. He ain't doing none of that shit. You'd die before I do that. Maybe next time. Maybe um, be a little bit smarter next time, buddy. I owe you so much, mister. Yeah, that's two times you owe me, bro. Me neither. Well, I best be getting back to town. Stiff one tonight. Yeah. That's it. You ain't getting another out. Exactly. All right, guys. Let's go ahead and do another interaction or mission. This will all be sorted out soon. I promise. I don't know what is going on, but let's see if we can help. I'm losing business left and right. Oh damn! I need to get someone to get rid of them for me. I'll pay very well. I just need it done. All, All right. right. Calm down. Let me see what I can do. Oh, thank God. Just be sure not to bang around the place too much. What the hell got into my horse, bro? My horse decided he was not feeling that train being that close. All right. So, locate and kill rats. All right. There we go. Come on, little buddies. All right, where are you? Oh, there you are. Damn, bro, how did you get this bad? All right, I don't know how many there are, but we're playing exterminator. Oh, there we go. There we go. Oh yeah, we're killing them, buddy. Don't you worry about that. Oh, one's growing on your table. Oh, disgusting. All right. Oh, damn. I didn't even know he was. I thought I killed him. Where you going, little buddy? Oh, damn. He's invisible. He took two shots that time, bro. All right. Um, well, not there. Um, is there another one somewhere? Or do we have to pick them up? Is it one of those things where you have to, like, pick up the carcasses and stuff like that? Like, you can't leave them? Alright, well. Apparently we've got to do cleanup duty as well, apparently. Um, oh, wait. Where are you? Come on. Alright, there we go. All right, so it looks like we got a new cleanup duty as well. That's not too bad. I'm not worried about it. We'll probably just get rid of these or sell them or 
whatever. Don't really think you can use the rats that much, so as far as us being able to do anything with it, it's probably not going to happen, so we can just go ahead and, um, okay, well then, where the hell is the other one at then? Apparently there's one more somewhere. I mean, I hear it. There we go. Ooh, thanks, mister. Take this. Ooh, you earned every cent. I killed my All right. $13, bro. Exterminators in real life get way more money than that. All right, guys. Thank you so much for all your love and support, and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.